people, you say power. People. Power. People. Power. People. Power. When I say, show me what community looks like, say, this, this is, is what, what community, community looks, looks like. like. Show me what community looks like. This is what community looks like. Show me what community looks like. This is what community looks like. When I say, show me what black unity looks like, say, this is what black unity looks like. Show me what black unity looks like. This is what black unity looks like. Show me what black unity looks like. This is what black unity looks like. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> we are here today to uplift black women, to celebrate the black woman who helped build this country black woman who persisted and resisted and even put a man in space yeah. today we are celebrating the black women who fight for us every single day black women who show us what magic looks like yes. my name is hamdi muhammad and i am the cousin of muna also known as tota she was recently murdered in city heights by her husband, her husband killed her um, this last week and we are fighting to get justice for her and it's been a really painful process. Muna was a loving, a sweet, caring person who was a mentor to many young black girls in this city through her daycare center that she had. I also want to take this opportunity to remind us the importance of standing together during these really hard times. To stand up for the rights of black women to demand justice to be served for black women here and everywhere in the world. We have heard this and we've heard this many times. The most disrespected, neglected, unprotected person in this world is the black woman. Today, the Center for Disease and Control Prevention reports that black women experience the highest rate of homicide of any racial group in the United States. In fact, the homicide rates for black women and Native American women were found to be twice that of Asian, Hispanic, and white women in this country. Today, thousands of young black girls are missing around the United States, and often none of us know what their name, uh, say their names, say their names. Most of us don't even know their names. It is reported that black girls and women represent about 7% of America, but over 35% of all those missing person cases in the United States. These disproportionate percentages are outrageous. And at the same time, it's not common knowledge, and that needs to change. We must fight every day for black girls in this country to have the opportunity to pursue their dreams without fear and obstruction, period. We must. We must fight for black girls and women and women of color in all levels in this country. We must demand economic opportunity, fairness and equity and safety for all black girls. Yes. Muna was a fighter. She was a fighter for justice. She was a fighter for fairness. She was a fighter for everyday people. We must stand up together as a community and demand justice to be served for Muna and every single black girl that's missing in this country. Thank you guys all for being here. Appreciate you.